Morning, just off to the hairdressers to get my hair cut. Obviously, oh. safety, safety. Yeah, so just off to the hairdresser to get my hair cut. It's quarter past eight. Hopefully, I'm not going to be in there too long because I've got a bit of work at half nine. So, <clears throat> I don't want to come back and have a shower. Got a hair off myself. I hate having my hair cut. When I was about, I don't know, when I was about five, I used to scream go proper mental. <laughs> I hate having my hair cut. I hate the hairs going down my back. It's proper, I hate it. It's nasty. But, got to have it done, haven't we? Got to have it done. So yeah, hopefully get rid of some of these grey hairs. Oh, traffic everywhere, as usual. It's only a small town, you know what I mean? There's traffic everywhere. Go around the back ways today, but we Yeah, so today's vlog, yes, sorry, yesterday's vlog, only went up today, if that makes any sense, because it still had half hour left at quarter to 12 last night, and I weren't staying up. I couldn't stay up that late. Yeah, she nearly walked out the road. Yeah, and I weren't staying up that late because oh, I was knackered. I was barely kept my eyes awake, and I couldn't, I couldn't publish it straight away because I was waiting to write some more on it, which I did this morning. So it's up now anyway. Yeah. Oh dear. I feel absolutely knackered. I did want to get up a little bit earlier and go for my haircut, but let's hope there's not many people in there. Listen to the turbo. Fucking prick. What a fucking prick. I should just let him smash straight into the side of me, shouldn't I? What a wanker. Fucking divs. Anyway. So yeah. I did want to get up a little bit earlier. <clears throat> oh dear. Fucking just pulling out. It'll wire me up. Best not many. Best not be loads of people in this hairdressers. <coughs> I hope not anyway. Just coming up to it now. Here we go. Parking right outside. Result. There's no one in there. What's the result? See you in a minute. Haircut done. Nice and short-ish. Not too bad. My new style. <laughs> yeah. I'm not one for going to the hairdressers and going, oh, I want this, I want that. I'm just like, cut my hair, will ya? I don't want to mess about of it. Maybe back in the day, but not anymore. Cut out a bit of them greys. Oh, grey hair. Nasty. I think my dad was completely grey by the time he was 30. So, not great, but there you go. I reckon I'd be completely grey by the time I'm 40. Definitely. Got hair everywhere. So it's now eight minutes to nine o'clock. I've got to get home, have a shower, have breakfast, and be at work for half nine. Bearing in mind, it takes me 15 minutes to walk to work, which is lovely. Oh, that looks like a nice Skoda. Oh, I do like them. Is it VXRs? Something like that. God, they do look nice, especially in blue. Nice, tidy. Oh dear. So yeah, that took about, I don't know, what time did I go in there? I don't know, but it took, it took a time. Dave cut me hair, old Dave. Dave's been cutting me hair for, I don't know, God knows how long. Since I was young. So yeah, I always go to the same hairdressers. Um, Lauren cut my hair last time, which was alright, but she's always busy. <clears throat> and if you go to somewhere like, well, that's what they do, then you're going to get your hair cut without messing about, aren't you? So, yeah. No, it looks alright to me. Looks alright to me. Does the job. Looks like it's going to be a lovely day today. <clears throat> so if it's a busy day, I could do with a busy day today as well. Um, hopefully Sharon's gonna come around tonight, finish off my desk, get that up. Um, 
Gonna give a skirt and another coat. Make sure that's all right. And I think the next done. We're done and dusted. This has got me other light in. So tonight my office could be finished. Then I can start moving a few bits in there. Excited, excited, exciting stuff. So I'll give Sharon a ring in a minute and say, Oi, what's going on, boy? I'm just sitting at work. I've just watched James Peverick's third video. Well, it's worth a watch, I tell you that. I'm not going to say nothing else apart from that. Apart from the fact that um, he's, withdrawed, he's withdrawn an amount of money, which I'm glad, he is, glad that he's done, but at the same time, he's on about the re curse of the reverse. Obviously, you can cancel it and transfer the money. The money that he's transferred, I know, it's, I know it sounds silly, but if it was me and I was in his position, I'd smash the laptop up. I just ruined the laptop so so I couldn't play it. It just you know what I mean? And then with the money that he's got, just go out and buy a new one because if he plays again, he's gonna lose it all. He's playing he's playing silly. I mean I'm <clears throat> I'm not saying I haven't done it before. I do <clears throat> I used to do hundred pound spins in the bookies. But he's doing two hundred and twenty five pound spins and three hundred and spins it's silly but he's he's on about obviously starting from day one again of not gambling again but i reckon it's a bit hard for him because he's gonna think to yourself i'll just won free well, i've told you now he's what he's he just withdrawn three grand three grand he's withdrawn and he's put 200 quid in to get that now, 200 pound to win three grand is a result. I mean, bearing in mind, he went down to 26 pound. He went up to over a thousand, went down to 26. He's, I was saying, I was just basically shouting at it, saying, take the money when he was over two grand. Then he played more, and he, I think he was actually up to 3,100 and something at one point. But yeah. He withdrawed three thousand four hundred and forty-four pound and twenty pence. Yes, which was a good thing to do because if it was me, I'd have played the forty-four pound. But he thought to himself, "No, I'm going to stop here and I'm going to withdraw the lot, even the twenty pence." I've done the lot. I don't know. I hope he doesn't go back on it. But we will see. I'm sure there's going to be a few more videos from him now. Um, that's going to be hard for him, I reckon. That is going to be hard. I hope he don't reverse that. I hope he gets the free ground and does some decent stuff with it. Even if he goes back on it, as long as he gets that free ground back out and does a few bits of decent stuff with it, then fair enough. But free ground. I'd love to win free ground. Don't make me want to go and put 200 quid in the account now and try and win it. No way. No way. Just lucky. It's a lucky day, isn't it? It's his lucky day. When he goes back on there and puts another 200 quid in, it go like that. Tsh, and get fit. Oh, and I put another 200 quid in. Tsh, gone, 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 gone. I'll be very shocked if none of that money goes back in there. Very, very, very shocked. He did, I reckon he'd do a grand of that all day long within the next week or so. I might be wrong. But yeah, we will see. Very, very strange. But there you go. Just thought I'd tell you that I've watched it. I will put his link to his channel below so you can go and, go and watch it. Um, sorry I said the amount, but it was in my it was in it was in my conversation, so I had to say it. But yeah. So I just watched the rest of my film. <clears throat> Good film. I like that. Went too bad. I'm sure I said it before, but there you go. Anyway, so I just went and cash my um two cash rich. Cash which cash words, sorry. One was a winner and one wasn't. <clears throat> one was six quid. And I bought a five pound super rich. And I won. There you go. Four across the top. And then you got four in the middle. Two at the bottom. Hundred quid. 
There's a nice little win, weren't it? That don't happen very often. Just on a little random one. Five pound, 100 quid back. Nice. So today all I've actually spent on scratch cards is six pound. And I'm 94 pound up. That don't happen very often, does it? So I just spoke to Mother Care and we're off to get Isabel's new seat tonight. They've got one left in stock. I'll put, put it on reserve for myself. So Stacey's picking me up in about 10 minutes. And then we're off to Mother Care to go and pick Isabel's new car seat up, which is going to cost me 70 quid. But it's not going to cost me nothing because I'm putting it on my Love the Shop card, which is what I get for selling SIM cards. I get points every time I sell a SIM card and I saved up 250 quid worth. So I took 250 quid <clears throat> off them, got them to put it on my Love the Shop card. So I'm gonna get it for free. And then we're gonna get Molly a trampoline at the weekend. Hello, hello, hello. What's going on here then, my mush? Got me new helmet. What had, didn't you? I think the prices are. Um... What? You like that, didn't you? I've always wanted to be a policeman. Look, I'm even considering getting this. It's got a light on top. Look at that. It's even got a neck strap. What do you think, Isabel? <laughs> like it? It's a nut, isn't it? Don't undo it, please. Hello, 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 hello. Isabel's new car seat. There you go. Hey! My babies! And Molly got some babies. Boy, one big girl. Boy, one big girl. Boy, one big girl. All right, okay. <laughs> Couldn't get the grey one, so I had to get that one, which was 90 quid instead of 70 quid, but such is life. We are finished. Look at that worktop. Look at that. All cut in, professional. No crap round here. Look at that. We're all in. Chrome legs. One there, one there. So that's going to be a um, Thunderbolt screen there. Very nice. So yeah, one more bit to do, which I forgot to get myself. Metal strip there. And there's a metal strip at the door. That's it. We're done. We're done. It's taken a bit of time, but we're finally there. And I'm very, very, very happy. Yeah, so big thanks to Shaz for doing it all. What a top man. Thanks to Simon as well for doing the lights and the plugs. It's good having good mates, isn't it? Gotta love it. Okay. Right, thanks for watching today's vlog. If you liked it, please give it a thumbs up. And if you're not already, subscribe buttons down there. Subscribe to see lots more of me and my family. See you later. Bye.